need you to choose. Are you with me? Or are you with Monet? Welcome back again to my channel guys, how are we all doing? Happy new week to each and every one of you and thank you so much for your constant support on this channel. Today we're going to be looking at two different stories. We're going to be looking at the story of 50 Cent and Flavor Nabania. And the second story is going to be that of Jackie Apia, the Ghanaian actress and what she did in Nigeria recently. You guys need to watch the end of this video because it's going to be a juicy story. Subscribe if you're new and don't forget to turn your post notification on also give this video a massive thumbs up so it's been reported that 50 cent paid flavor over a billion naira for his song game changer to be used in his movie power book girl season 4 episode 9 the song was used for a marriage scene as you're seeing on your screen and nigerian designer was paid to do the outfit when i saw the news i'm like wait a minute they are even spraying money just like nigerian wedding i just needed to confirm is this true and i went to look for the movie for you guys to confirm that the song was actually played in this scene the girl in the movie is of evil origin and this is uncle here is chinedu so that is why nigeria was you know involved in this scene it's interesting to watch actually and i'm happy for flavor for putting africa on the map for putting nigeria out there congratulations to him one thing i love about flavor is that he's always had a way of incorporating evil tradition and evil culture to his music and i love that <laughs> able to play the music for you guys because of copyright issue we cannot risk that but the song was played and you can see from the movie that almost everybody was wearing Igbo tradition i can brag about this i can hit my chest and say it i can boldly say that nigerian music industry is the only industry so far that is making us proud that is actually putting nigeria out there for people to see, see that we are still relevant and well done to each and every one of them congratulations to flavor let's jump into the next Ghanaian beautiful actress Jackie Appiah recently visited Nigeria for a movie room, which she shared on her Instagram story. She actually vlogged the process and shared it with you. We are going to watch the vlog. But then I want to talk about something that one Ghanaian actress came out here to say some time ago. How Nigerian movie industry is not supportive of the Ghanaian movie industry and how they don't give role and all that. She had a lot to say. I'm not even here to talk about her. But then jackie shared this her story and that made me to like reflect on what that lady said let's watch jackie's vlog then we'll come back to digest it fly with me to nigeria for a movie shoot so i got to the airport and to my delight the hotel I was staying at has sent a chauffeur to pick me up you guys remember this hotel from one of my past videos the delboro yeah that's them so we picked up my luggage and then we headed to the car they sent me <laughs> a Rolls Royce, guys, to pick me up because that's what I wanted. To give you the option to choose which car you want to be picked up in. And me, I chose the Rolls Royce. <laughs> it's always the presidential treatment with the Delboro. So this is us now heading to the hotel with the security and me feeling like a boss chick. Charlie, I enjoyed the ride, Papa. <laughs> I had a very warm reception when I arrived at the hotel. The very lovely staff was there to greet me. Everybody is always smiling here. They are so friendly, so nice. Um, they offered me the red towel and a cocktail as well. That tasted really good. Then I went to check in. As usual, they had a custom welcome message waiting for me in the elevator. These guys really understand hospitality because I don't see all of this in Paris. So, hey, it was time to head to my room and waiting for me in the room was another Delboro favorite. The custom carved watermelon with my name. And if you're wondering if I finished everything in there, yes, I did. Just look at the bedroom. Just incredible. So he showed me around the room, showed me my pajama set. This guy casually mentioned that they have champagne for me, only for me to find out that it was <laughs> Crystal. Crystal is not just any champagne. It is Crystal. You need to make an announcement. Like, I will have Crystal waiting for you here. Okay. Anyway, up next is the bathroom. I am very particular about bathrooms. So this is very important to be wherever I stay. My bathroom must be neat. I am really impressed with the hotel. And finally, it was time for me to rest before I headed to set. I scheduled for a medical wellness check with the hotel. 
It's part of the hotel. Oh, so nice to finally meet you. How are you? Your feels are fantastic. Oh, thank you. Please have your seat. Thank you. <laughs> So they have an in-house consultant trained in the UK who also happens to be a professor of medicine. I booked a comprehensive wellness check, including all vitals. The best part is that results are out in just five minutes, guys. It's like having your own private health concierge, you know, setting the gold standard for health and wellness. Okay, so what time did you have so, your last meal? So um, at this point, four I'm talking and I told her I have my last meal at 4 a.m. in the morning. Uh, and then she advised me on the right stuff to eat. And then it was time for her to go. It was also time for me to um, go on set. You know, I said I was here for a movie shoot and um, got on the set, which is Everybody Loves Jennifer. Went straight into the trailer and got ready. And after a shoot that ended at 2 a.m i was back to the hotel it was really serene at this time of the night got to my room and was met with this incredible surprise that took my breath away this is the reason why this hotel has my heart they know how to pamper somebody you know me i love to be pampered guys i love to be pampered you know their attention to details and the level of care they give to their clients just look at the balloons and roses ah and on top of it all, they added this package, opened it, and it was a daily planner. All right, guys, catch you on the next vlog. Bye. Jackie is actually in Nigeria for a movie, and she's a Ghanaian. And someone was saying some time ago that the Nigerian movie industry, no, they give Ghanaians the kind of support where Niger Ghanaians, they give them. Do you remember that interview from weeks ago? Look at it here. Yeah, we <laughs> oh, you can me and I go for my boss and me any any one minute. Them according to her, they don't support us like we support them. The kind of embrace that we Ghanaians give Nigerians are not the same as what they also replicate to us, which is why it is a put off and of which she even cited an example. One of the problems we'll have as individuals or people is pushing blame. Like we'll try to push blame on people. Yeah, the one that is doing me, my village people is doing me and all that. This lady came out to say that Nigerian movie industry does not support Ghanaian movie industry as much as they support us. I made a video that time and I asked about Jackie Apia. Where is Jackie Apia? Because I'm, I'm on YouTube. I, I don't see her movies on YouTube and I know she was making movies. But somebody came to correct me that Jackie is making Netflix video uh, movies and not YouTube videos. I went to check her out and she's doing amazing things for herself. I've known Jackie from the days of high school up to this moment and she's still booming. She's still relevant. Everybody's still hearing about her. That is because she constantly work in developing herself and in growing herself and looking out for the market that is working and going into it you can't just sit down and be complaining about support when you're not doing anything for us to support jackie is doing a great thing and nigerians are supporting her because she's working so this auntie cannot just sit down in one corner of ghana doing her cooking show and whatever she have going on with her and expect her to come and support your cooking show that you're doing in your language and all that okay so if you do something that concerns us of course we'll come and support you thank you so much for watching today's video let me know your thoughts in the comment section and congratulations to jackie appear on her amazing achievement bye bye i'll see you guys in my next one